Hey everybody, Ernie Hatmaker here. I'm at the pea patch this morning um, trying to once again beat the rain. <laughs> and it's just, I don't know, maybe 30 minutes away now. Um, I've already felt a few drops on my face. But I've been harvesting peas. Um, you guys remember that I waited a, a, another um, four or five days to see how big some of these peas would get. And I had no idea these vines were almost three feet tall. So last minute better than no minute, right? <laughs> That's me. Last minute earning. Um, trying to, um, as I've been told, it's called French weave these uh, strings up so I can get this makeshift trellis and get these peas hung over it because they're just attaching to each other and just kind of laying down, which wouldn't be so bad if that was all I had out here or if, you know, they had stayed in the rows that I had made them in, which they did not. So now I'm playing catch up and I've got a few uh, squash leaves I need to uh, cut off that look kind of ugly. But anyway, so uh, I would say better late than never, but these peas weren't having this little stringy stuff. I'm going to have to get um, either um, some chicken wire or some rope, like clothesline or, or some harder twine or something like that to come out here and string them up because I don't want to pull them. And honestly, you know me, I don't want to cut them loose. I want every single thing I can get. If they want to grow all crowded together, then I'm just going to have to catch some of those peas when they're full grown and I'll just save them for seed instead of dehydrating or canning or eating them. So anyway, that's what I'm doing out here in the rain once again. <laughs> I appreciate you watching. See you in the comments.